Hey everyone, this is Vickerman and welcome to Crusader Kings 2. Uh, today we're going to be playing through one of these Monarch Journey uh, specific challenges. Uh, this particular one is the the newest one in the set. Uh, this is Kagan, I guess you would say, Liao Hongzhi. So he is uh, Buddhist, so the challenges are um, kind of... Well, this first one is related to that. Temples managed by Buddhists, 0 of 4. Uh, we need to have 0 of 100 provinces. So we, we need 100 provinces. That's an insane amount, really. Uh, and we need two clans to like us. You can see we're going to get different scoring based on uh, those goals. And as you get more score, you start unlocking uh, different customization options more than anything here so without further ado we're gonna get started so bronze man you can have multiple saves for each playthrough I mean I think we're just gonna go with Iron Man cuz why not and I'm gonna leave everything the same that's fine so this is pretty exciting because I don't think I've ever actually uh, played in the region where this guy is. It's in uh, sort of the far eastern corner of the map here, uh, but not in India. So it's a bit north of that. So let's see what is going on. So I'm going to lose this empire for some reason. Because it does not have the same succession, I imagine. Intending to enforce their subjugation as a tributary state of the Song Empire, the Protectorate General Wang Shao of the Western Protectorate has declared war upon Jayapala Bamapala. Han armies are already marching towards the realm of Maharajala Japala, and it seems possible this spells the end of the Bamapala independence. So which one is the Western Protectorate? Khan Wan, uh, uh, the Wanya clan used a favor on Khan Dart Kindas just to force them to join all their factions. We have a lot of factions going on here. Ah, independence. Yeah, I'm uh this is not a great start. So I don't know, can we uh, just get these guys into our, into the fold? Should be able to beat their army. Uh, we had looters. So we cannot declare war. Oh, he's a tributary of ours. That is why. He is not independent. 
Oh, that's because this is the actual capital. Now we can do an invasion. By Khan Uziel of the Uzi clan. All right. Oh, there we go. We are pregnant. He has 500 troops. Regarding your marshal, it seems he's been using soldiers to extort money. Um, so... I think ultimately this is probably the better way to go because there's people are just going to be upset anyway. Has created the title Duchy of Kange. So, not super clear here. So these guys, what do you got going on here? Give a lot of troops. So I think our MO is really going to be maybe do some looting and then build some holdings. Hopefully we'll actually be able to do that. And it'll be pretty uh, tricky. Because it just takes a lot of gold still. It occurred to me that my wife is feeling somewhat gloomy as of late. The burden of her unborn child is surely causing some humoral unbalance. Uh, we lose five gold. Sure, let's give it a try. Got 17 gold. Well, uh, what's he doing? We have a bo a daughter, Xiao Win. All right, so let's see about.
We can get some alliances, I think, maybe by... I don't know, will this do that? Probably not, actually. Alright, do I have any decisions I can take? Form the Chosen of Ashoka. Holding a Diwali Fest Feast. Sure. To properly celebrate the seasonal feast, you should invite all your vassals. You have to describe or write the letters to send them off and the messengers. Satchels decorated with flowers. It will be a grand feast. Um, yeah, that's fine. I'm getting a little bit confused because I'm like, I'm thinking some of the stuff that I've been reading about CK3. But they're not true here. Castle is decorated with flowers. Welcome all. I guess, yeah, there's no actual holdings there. Let us celebrate. The feast is over, but it was fantastic. The guests make their way home. You sit down and smile to yourself. Pleased at how things turned out. What? All right, we're going to see if we can uh, bop them. Oh, that's done for us. Seem uh, reasonable. What is this one? Uh, traditionally, a high-ranking official bestowing it on someone is a sign of approval. Yeah, you can auto-assign commanders, that's fine. In my opinion, rule, the world would be more chaotic, but fun place. If I keep following the laws, the world will have less chaos, but also less fun. Uh, we should try to get just. I don't think we did, but. That's okay. Mm -hmm. 
Let's loot these guys. Uh, two peasant families have been locked in a bitter feud for generations. Yeah, let's try to try to fix things here. You invited them. The peasants are seated at two opposing tables on either side of the position. Some have brought pitchforks. One clutches a live chicken. And all of them look moderately inbred. This could be a challenge. Uh, flatter. My friends, you say with this warm smile. I think you know why I've called your great families here. As you suffer from this tragic conflict, the entire realm suffers with you. Uh, soothe their tempers. Many of you are angry, I know. You have every reason to be. Too much blood has been spilled between your families for things to be smoothed over. But there comes a time when one has to look to the future. Oh, we could threaten them with violence. <laughs> for dramatic effect, you pull out a dagger and stab it into the table with all your might. Because if you do not... I can assure you that there will be no future for your families. I will personally hunt down every single one of you and make sure that the peasants shout you down. <laughs> you barely have time to dodge the chicken someone hurls your way. With a howl, the two families leap over their tables and throw themselves at each other with you caught in the middle. Clothes torn and covered in bruises, you eventually manage to crawl out of the inn. As the fighting continues, well, I did my best. That's true. Because you're really terrible. Are we kind of ma are we kind of maxed out here? I think we are now. But yeah, I kind of need as many troops as I can can zero are you kidding uh someone's plotting to kill me i mean i am paranoid so that could actually not be true All right, so what should you do with your life there, kid? You're my heir, aren't you? Uh, what traits do you have? Affectionate, haughty, rowdy. Oh, you're depressed, great. It is used to recruit hordes and to reinforce them. You cannot recruit hordes to go above this limit, and you should make sure you have enough unused manpower to reinforce your horde when needed. Maybe that's part of it. All right, let's go back home. Spending more time with my wife. And we are in love. Well, we could like bop some of these armies before declaring war, you know. Yeah, I just... I'm not sure what you do in this situation.
because we're just profoundly weak compared to everyone else. Education focus. Probably Marshall is a bad, a good idea. Ugh. Is there a society that can help us out? The Savaka Sangha. To live only on what others give them. Okay. Eagle Warriors. Why don't we join that? Kagan Hassan of Zetsu of the Eagle Warriors greets me with a brief nod. Another recruit, huh? To join our ranks, you need to prove yourself, boy. The man says gruffly, folding his arms across the chest. You'd be fighting one of our own. Still interested, my lord? You agree to duel whoever they have chosen. I have a negative two personal combat strength. <laughs> yeah, that's probably not a great idea. <laughs> Maybe I'll join the other. We are delighted your decision to join our ranks. Together we shall strive to the betterment of ourselves. All right, I don't think we have necessarily anything we can do with... Well, no, we, we've got... Makes you lose wicked traits and gain pious ones over time. Okay. That's actually good. Uh, my wife has offered to travel to the Song Empire on a mission to bring glory. Please, my lord, let a humble servant strengthen your relations with the emperor. Uh, lights up like the sun before rushing off to pack her belongings. Um, sure. I'm assuming you're coming back. <laughs> 